Hey y'all, Grill Girl here. I am answering your questions from our Facebook page. And the next question that we have today is from Sam in DC. And he is asking uh, about grilling fish on your grill and um, kind of lamenting about how a lot of times flaky fish get stuck to the cooking grids. So yeah, that is definitely annoying. And I will tell you that the only time or way I cook any kind of seafood is out on the grill. And that's because I hate the way that seafood makes my house smell. So I love to put it out on the grill and cook it out there and let it do its thing out there. And then I can eat it outside or inside and we um, basically save the house from that. So there are definitely a couple of things that you wanna know about cooking your fish on the grill. Uh, the first thing is that you're just gonna wanna be aware of how your grill works in general. If you have any hot spots on your grill, you're gonna really wanna avoid those when you're cooking fish. If there's any area of your grill that flares up, first of all, you might wanna give us a call because we can help with that. But um, for the reality of cooking fish on it, you just want to avoid any of those spots that specifically flash up um, heat or flames. Uh, you will want to have your cooking grids fairly clean for this, even though in a previous video I told you kind of that that's what gives your food flavor. When you're talking about cooking fish, you definitely want to have the excess um, residue kind of scrubbed off of the grates. And you can do that with a brass cooking grid brush. Um, the best things to cook on the grill are going to be your firm flesh fish. So that's something like salmon or halibut, tuna, and you're going to want to cook at least an inch thick fillets. And that will really help you um, keep from getting everything stuck to the grate. But um, if you're going to do that, you can cook those directly on the cooking grids or the grates. Uh, you just want to coat the outside of the fish in an oil and also coat the cooking grid with oil. And what, the way you can do that is just put some on like a paper towel and rub it onto the grid. Um, and so that will kind of help with that. If you're cooking a more delicate fish or thinner filet, you actually don't want to put that directly onto the cooking grid at all. So what you'll want to do is either um, make like an aluminum foil pan for it and cook on the aluminum foil. If you're going to do that, you can put a little piece of parchment paper between the fish and the aluminum foil and that way um, it won't stick to the aluminum foil either. You can also opt to grill corn the same day and wrap your um, more delicate fish in the corn husks and cook those directly on the grate. Um, and finally, you can also use one of those handy cedar planks that you can just get at most grocery stores. Um, so yeah, you're gonna wanna do about 10 minutes on the grill per inch of filet. And if you really love cooking your fish on the grill, you should probably invest in one of those really like wide spatulas uh, that will help flip it and make sure that it doesn't stick to the grate. So anyway, I hope that helps. Happy grilling and thanks for your question.